Okay, welcome to the Northern Mockingbird. Uh, Northern Mockingbird is actually a new bird for us this year. Um, Northern Mockingbird has been showing up on campus uh, more recently in the past few years, and we've often come across it, so I felt like it would be great to add to our list this year of birds that we already are familiar with in hopes that, that the Mockingbird will come back again. Behaviorally, the Mockingbird is a really interesting bird. Um, not afraid to harass other birds, um, often will mimic other birds in terms of their call, um, and they, they do sing a lot, almost all of the time. The mockingbird has a very, very long tail in compared to its body. Um, field marks include a very gray back and head, a lighter shade of, of gray, even some brown on the breast and side flank area, black and white streaking through its wings. It is a robin sized bird. Again, make note of the color pattern here. That will identify some of the field marks for you. And also for the mockingbird, make note of the behavior. You can scroll through some pictures here, some field mark pictures. Hope, hope you've been noticing in these that we watched that, that they do identify for you in these the field marks there that are particularly prevalent. Your real sense of how long the tail is compared to the body itself. We're learning one ID for this bird, males and females, similar. And let's give a listen. video of the Mockingbird. Sense of how gray it is, really not much color to this bird at all. Gray, white, a little bit of black. Longer beak. All right, and there we have the Northern Mockingbird, new bird this year. Hopefully we get to see a bunch on campus.